Hello Leo, today I'm going to show you another unboxing video by me for you. Today let me introduce you this band bow spray gun. It's a paint gun in a really good looking um, format and it works really cool because I painted a lot of a car um, stuff with it and it works and it makes a really good job. The Banbo PK60 is a multi-purpose paint gun for daily use in paint shops and workshops. It is the prize performance winner of Banbo's PK range. We will receive a really well-made high-quality spray gun that can easily compete with similar models from other manufacturers. And that's right. The body is made of high quality aluminium and the needle and tip are made of stainless steel. The spray gun has no O-ring installation and all seals are made from Teflon. It can work with a variety of liquids without leaking or rusting. They have completely redesigned the Banbo PK60 to give it a particularly comfortable and ergonomic design. Several variants were tested by the partner companies and this shape was preferred by a large number of professional painters out there. The spray gun is very comfortable and can be guided incredibly precisely because it is so lightweight um, but it can still be held with a firm and secure grip. The beam can be adjusted to suit our preferences and the material is always precisely and evenly atomized. This cap consumes a lower air volume and creates a medium pressure. Um, the maximum pressure is 3 bar and you will um, work with standard paint for a car for example with 2 bar. That means it works really good in it. The essentially, it is used less air than an HVLP air cap, but with a little more pressure than an HVLP. The end and result is that the transmission efficiency is similar to that the HVLP air guns, approximately 60% of it. It comes um, with an in my case with two needles, one is 1.8 millimeter and the other is one point, I think it was four. The 1.4 is for the basic and um, clear coating and the 1.8 version of the needle is for thicker paint. Spray painting is a painting technique in which a device sprays coating materials like paint, ink, varnish, etc through the air onto a surface. The most common types employ compressed gas, usually air, to atomize and direct the paint particles. Spray guns evolve from airbrushes and the two are usually distinguished by their size and the size of the spray pattern they produce. Airbrush are handheld and used instead of a brush for detailed work such as photo retouching. Painting nails or the fine art. Air gun spraying use generally larger equipment like here. It is typically used for covering large surfaces with an even coating of liquid. Spray guns can be either um, automated or handheld and have interchangeable heads to allow for different spray patterns. Here the most of the needles versions are matches to it because um, the brand Banbo comes and gives you an offer of a lot of needle uh, dimensions in, on the market and um, it works with compressed air. The processor occurs when the paint is applied to an object through the use of an air pressure spray gun. The air gun has a nozzle, paint bathroom and an air compressor. Of course you have to buy separately an air compressor and this air compressor should um, perform 
uh, I bought a um, compressor with 50 liter of capacity and 10 bar work temperature, but I can um, press it down to the uh, four, uh, four or three bars and this works with that um, paint gun here really good. It works really good as you can see here. It's a good um, paint job what I did, <laughs> of course. Do a wide range of nozzle shapes and size. The consistency of the paint can be varied. The shape of the works piece and desired paint constantly and patterns are important factors when we choosing a nozzle. The three most common nozzles are the full cone, the hollow cone and the flat stream. Here you can make an um, and full cone and a flat stream. You can choose between these two spray nozzles um, in, in a rotation um, of function. It's really easy to uh, adjust this. And then you can make uh, a good pressure gun job here. In a manual operation, the method the air gun uh, spray is held by a skilled operator, of course, about 6 to 10 inches. These are 15 up to 25 centimeters from the object. And we move back and forth over the surface, each stroke overlapping the previous to ensure a continuous coat. In an automatic process, the gun head is attached to a mounting block and delivers the stream of paint from that position. The object being painted is usually placed on rollers or on turntable to ensure overall equipped coverage of all sides. Then we can make here um, a full cone and of course a flat stream with it. These nozzles, nozzles are built in in the spray gun. And um, then we can make a good gun and spray job. Spray painting is a really good thing to paint, for example, your car. For, for example, you have a damaged part of your car, you have to remove that part from your car, then you have to sand it um, with, um, with, 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 um, with 600 up to 800 er sand paper, and um, then you have to clean it. After this, you apply the first layer of paint. And for this, you can use this spray gun here, the Benbo PK60 for it, no prop. The pressure is, which you should use, um, should be um, two up to three bar. And then you can apply the paint job with it. After this job, of course, you have to clean the entire gun. Then the next step is the clear coating, one or two layers of them, and then you have a really good um, painted um, car part again, um, and you have to not you have not to replace it. You can fix it by using a paint gun here, and this band uh, bow gun, the PK60, is a really good gun for for beginners and for semi professionals. It makes a good spray. It makes a, um, a good um, coating. If you if you use a good paint, of course, it, it makes a good coating, and um, you can make a really good job with this um, gun really easily. This is a nice gun. This is the Banbo paint gun, um, the PK60, and um, I th um, say thanks for watching. Please subscribe me and give me important feedback. And I hope to see you again on my channel. Sun Sun!